Wow, what a day. Thank you, David Dice. This is a very momentous occasion, 15 years in the making. This one is unique. We have cantilevered architecture. We have a channel for the Purple Line. We have the Kefa Cafe on the first floor. We have a green roof. And it's very different from the last library. It shows that our libraries are changing from large warehouses of physical books to eco-friendly, tech-forward places where every generation can get together and access and share information. But as much as libraries have changed, what has not changed is the support for libraries. 95% of people in polls show, say that libraries play an important role in their communities and give everyone a chance to succeed. And 94% say that having a library improves their quality of life. Libraries are way more popular than every occupation, especially than elected officials. They're even more popular than baseball and apple pie. So remember that as we approach July 4th. Understandably, our county is very invested in libraries, and I was very glad for the budget that just passed. The county executive and then the county council added more money to extend the, the hours, to expand the collection in both English and Spanish, and to invest more in not just capital improvements, but maintenance. This library, though, here in Silver Spring is so important to me personally as the representative of the East County because it will be the one tool we need to help close the achievement gap in our public schools. We all know the most reliable predictor of a child's success in school is not class size, it's not teacher pay, it's not many things we have much more control over, it's family income. Well, we have a significant income disparity in Silver Spring and a wealth disparity, and that means we have a disparity in books and are available to our kids in our homes, in newspapers and magazines, in laptops and tablets, and we still have a persistent digital divide. So that's, this library isn't going to close that divide, but it's going to help us close some of those gaps because it's going to make top shelf resources available to kids from every part of this community and their parents if they come here and take advantage of them. So that's why it's going to play such an important role for me personally as we try to march forward and close the, the achievement gap in the East County. I want to just say a last word about the future. This library is a beautiful and special place, as George mentioned. We can see this beautiful edifice of stone and glass and steel. What we can't see is the impact it's going to have as the centerpiece of this community for a generation of all the lives that will be changed starting right here today.